Hello and welcome to more gaming fans. I am your host Joe Zamora here. And this week we have another battle of the SQL. Change the layout a little bit. Um uh, not gonna make us play any better, but <laughs> we're gonna see how it goes from here. Um we're gonna go ahead and lead Nobunaga and Prada. No, not Prada. And Petrie. Um really expecting him to utilize the sun. I do believe he's only allowed to use two legends at a time so let me just hopefully he knows that because if not i'll take the four i'll take the disqualification win um we'll bring punk rock in the back and king in the back as well so let's go ahead and see how this thing goes good luck have fun memphis maniac Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Again, guys, I am not expecting to win this at all. I just threw some stuff together. Hopefully, we can hit hard and uh, end the battle quickly because we ain't winning no stall fest for sure against that Ho Oh and uh, Lunala. And that was the first two Pokemon he let out. Okay, then. So, Nobunaga and Petrie are out here. I'm going to switch out Nobunaga because that's not who he's supposed to be defeating right here. Alright, so let's see. Switch out Nobunaga for Nido King. And let's go ahead and get a Rock Slide off. He's probably going to Dynamax something here, but eh, I'm not too worried about it. Well, I'm kind of worried if he uh, Dynamaxes the, the Lunala. But, ho uh oh we got answers for him. Alright, so King comes right out of the gate. Shiny and blue. Rock Slide comes off, and of course Lunala avoids it. But, ho uh oh doesn't. So down that thing goes right off the gate. Man, I was really hoping to get the flinch on Lunala. But he just goes for the moon blast here. Which is good for. Alright, Groudon, the bane of my existence, the Pokemon I've been worried about, comes in. Gets the drought up, which I have a plan for if I can get Rayquaza in here. But um I'm gonna go ahead and go for a Because we're Scarf. We're going to be faster than anything. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go for the Throat Chop, actually. And also, just go for another Rock Slide. I have Dual Wing Beat for Halucha if that thing comes in. But I doubt it. Alright, he's probably going to try to get like a Sword Stands up or something. So hopefully the Flinch works out in our favor. Ooh, side shot comes right off. King is going down, which is good, because now we get Rayquaza back in. Alright, so Swords Dance is up. So now he's where he wants to be. Um fuck. I don't know if we take it out with Solar Beam now on uh on uh Nobunaga here. But we're definitely gonna try. He's probably going to Dynamax, so I should probably Dynamax, too. So, let's go ahead. So, how much power does this do? 120. Dynamax. 140. Okay, so we're going to max Rock Ball here. I mean, sorry. Max Overgrowth here to Groudon. And, uh... I'm going to go Wide Guard on the off chance he doesn't. Is that a smart play? No, I'm just going to go for the Rock Slide. Take out Lunala. 
So obviously we're faster, so we get up first. I'm really surprised he kept Ho-Ho in on the first play there. He had to have figured the rock slide was coming, but I guess he thought it was bulky enough. Okay, so Groudon doesn't Dynamax here. Lunala goes down, and Groudon's about to take a big old grass move right here. So down goes Groudon. Gets a plus two, but doesn't do nothing with it. And we have a guest appearance by Silence over here. Yeah, they can see. <laughs> Alright, so Charizard comes out here. It's going to take a max rock fall and a rock slide. Potentially both. Whichever comes first. But definitely, uh, we get the sweep here. Well, not a sweep, but you know. We'd knock out a few good Pokemon there. And uh, should get the first match. Not sure what this Charizard actually has, but he's Dynamaxing it, so it's going to take one hit at least. Ooh, G Max Charizard. Oh, and almost goes down to the rock slide alone. Max Airstream into Nobunaga isn't enough. Oh, and it's going to go down to his own HP. So Charizard goes down there. No problem at all. So we do get the first battle. And now we can try and win a second one. Maybe we'll get our third win of the season. Be a personal three and six. Because when I took over the team, it was 0-4 or something like that. It's ridiculous. It was a bad team. All right, play with the same rules. Let's go again. And uh, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna lead uh, a little differently. Instead of Nobunaga right out of the gate, I'm gonna go ahead and just lead uh, Obstagoon and. Petri. So Punk Rock and Aerodactyl with Nobunaga in the back and um honestly I don't really need Prada. He might bring Ditto this time around though. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring Prada just in case. But I think uh, if he leads the same thing, we pretty much win right out. We'll probably get the 4-0. But I feel like he's going to switch it up a little bit. Yep, Halucha and Ditto. Two completely different Pokemon. But that's fine. So he's going to copy Obstagoon here, but he doesn't have Flame Orb, so his gut ain't going to be activated like ours will. So that I'm okay with. So we're going to go ahead and go Obstruct here. And we're going to go Dual Wing Beat into the Halucha. Thunder Punch might, not, uh, might go into Aerodactyl, but we should... Uh, Live it with the Focus Sash and Outspeed Halucha. Assuming the Ditto is Scarf, which I don't think it is in doubles. But you never know. Normally it is. Come on, come on. He's thinking now. He's wondering what we're planning. But I already know what I'm doing. 
dual wing beat right into Halucha. Obstruct to get that defense drop. He's probably going to want to attack into it. Oh, and he's maxing it. So it, I'm sure it's the Halucha here. So Halucha is going to go ahead and go into Obstagoon more than likely. We're going to Obstruct, so we should live, but depending on how heavy hitting that Halucha is, you never know. We might go down. Ditto goes Ice Punch into Petrie, so it is Scarf. And Dual Wing Beat into Halucha. And then Max Knuckle into Petrie as well. Okay, so he just wanted Petrie out of there. Alright, so he's locked into Ice Punch on Obstagoon. So I'm pretty safe to stay there. Now I'm going to go to Prada. Not yet. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and go... I'm built to take a hit though. So I'm going to go Thunder Punch into Halucha. And I'm going to go ahead and... Yeah, I was thinking as well. I'm going to Stone Edge into Halucha as well. I'm going to double into Halucha. So Ditto goes Ice Punch. We take that no problem. Punk Rock goes Thunder Punch. Almost takes down the Halucha. I should have Shadow Sneaked. Oh no, but we get the Speed Drop. And Stone Edge goes off into Halucha. And down goes his Dynamax. No problem at all. <laughs> I got nervous for a second. I was like, shit, did I fuck up? And now we're going to get some of those leftovers back. So now he's got an Obstagoon stuck in Ice Punch with no uh, no way to get burned. Or Toxic, really. Alright, and now he's got Groudon in. Yeah, I have Ice Punch. That's how he has it. So I'm going to go Ice Punch here. And I'm going to Will-O-Wisp as well. Into Groudon. Just in case he lives, we'll lower its attack. No, two times. He's only ground. Alright, so Ditto goes Ice Punch into Punk Rock. Interesting. But our Punk Rock goes Ice Punch into Groudon. Ooh, and it lives it really well. That's a bulky boy. But will o -Wisp does go off into the Groudon and cuts its attack in half. Alright, Prada avoided the attack. So only Obstagoon's going to get hit here. But we're living thanks to that attack drop with the will o -Wisp. And I think we're in a very good position here to take this battle. I don't know what item Groudon has, but I'm going to go for the knockoff. And I'm also going to go for the Stone Edge on the Ditto. Well, it still does damage, just not double damage. Yeah. Groudon almost goes down there, loses its Citrus Berry. Our Stone Edge goes into Obstagoon. Does almost half, but that's a crit, so. That's fine. And then Rock Slide comes off. That Groudon is really slow. So Punk Rock is here. And I'm going to... Ice Punch into Ditto. 
because I feel like he's going to go into Prada here. So I'm going to Shadow Sneak the Groudon, let him uh, take Prada down, and hopefully Punk Rock could do some good damage to Ditto. Oh, but he switches out and goes to Ho-Oh. Very interesting he would... Yeah. Eh. Yes and no. Ditto has no moves left, so it's struggling. Oh, that's even better. Because when Ditto changes form, it only gets 5 PP. And we get another crit there, but I don't think that one mattered. And interesting enough, Prada and uh, Optigoon are here on very low health. Punk Rock goes down. But it was a matter of time. He was burned. So we get Nobunaga back in here. Depending on who he switches in. We'll Dynamax and hit who we need to. So Groudon's going to come back in. We'll take that thing out with a Shadow Sneak. And we'll go Max Rockfall into Ho-Oh. And that'll be the end of the battle right there. And we'll get the clean 2-0. And our third win of the season. Since we took over anyway. And in general. Because there was no wins on this team. And Ho is specially defensive. So I want to ensure the kill. I don't want to just go for ancient power. And you know some crazy shit happen. That's, that's week, uh, I think, 8 or 9 of SQL right there, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time.